she came out of the water, she was so joyful. She said, hey, I'm born again. I'm a Christian. And this is a Muslim lady who came to faith, baptized not in public, but in a bathtub in somebody's house. And so you can do it quietly. You know what? She said, from that day, I have never heard that spirit calling me again. I have been free. And the Bible says, who the Son sets free is free indeed. And that's something that all of us want, a freedom to enjoy our faith, mm -hmm. a freedom to grow, a freedom to have peace, and a freedom to enjoy the blessings of God in our life. So uh, I hope this video <laughs> vlog is going to make it up onto your channel. And, uh, and then uh, I'll be happy to share uh, and take another video again uh, another time. <laughs> but that's pretty much it, Dave. Um, Dave, for, for us who read the Bible or follow Jesus, Jesus says that anyone who, who reads my word and does not do it is like a foolish man. The foolish man built his house on the sand and... When the rains came, the storm came, the wind came, uh, it beat against the house, but because the foundation was built on sand, it fell with a great crash. But a wise man, a, a, a man is like a man who reads the Bible and puts it into practice. A wise man, uh, the one who does that, who reads the Bible and practices it, who does it, who obeys it, is like a man who built a house on a rock, on a solid rock. He built the house, and the winds came, and the rains came, and, the, and they beat against the house. But because this, the rock was solid, the foundation was solid, the house stood firm. So which house do you want to be, Dave? Which house do we all want to be? Do we want to be the house of the foolish man, where we read the Bible and we don't put it into practice? Or we be the house that is built on the firm rock, where we read the Bible and put it into practice? That's the one we want to be. So today we've read about baptism. And I want to ask you, Dave, at a personal level, is baptism something that you would consider? Is it something that you, you would want to do and uh, follow Jesus? Because Jesus got baptized. He showed us. He modeled for us everything that he, he asked us to do. He himself, he did. And that's why he was such a great teacher, because he practiced that which he preached. So this is the person of Jesus. This is the command that Jesus asks us that we will go and make people followers of Jesus, Yeshu Bhakts, followers of Jesus. We follow Jesus and we follow him in obedience in all that he said and all that he did and modeled for us. So Dave, I think that's, that's